Hello everyone, welcome back for the second part of this tutorial. In this video we are going to model the lid. We are going to start with a sketch on the front plane. We're going to select line. Let's first draw a vertical line from the origin. Then a horizontal line. And let's make this profile. Now we're going to give this profile some dimensions. Click Smart Dimension. This line will be 40. This horizontal line will be 46. This line will be 22. And this line will be Seven. Now we're going to insert the sketch fillet. Click sketch fillet. Make this six. And select this line and this line. Click OK. Then we're going to close the sketch with an arc. So select arc. Select this point and this point and we're going to make the arc tangent so we're going to select the center line select this point make sure it's horizontal then click on this line hold shift click on this line and select tangent now we have our profile we go to features revolve we're going to select the axis, click on OK. After this we're going to draw the mouthpiece. We're first going to insert the plane. So select the bottom, go to reference geometry, plane, and the plane will have an offset of 74. And we're going to flip the direction, click OK. And we're going to sketch on the plane. And we're going to select center line. And we're going to draw a center line from the origin to somewhere around here. And give this line a dimension of 22. Then select the circle and sketch a circle on this point. And we're going to give this circle a dimension of 28. Then we're going to features and we're going to extrude the circle and select extrude up to next. Click OK. This lid has a flip cap, and we're going to create an opening for the axis of the flip cap. We're going to use the, this plane again. Click on sketch. And we're going to select center line and draw another line from this point to the right. We're going to give this line a dimension of 21. And we're going to select center rectangle. We're going to draw a rectangle from this point and give this rectangle a dimension of 19 by 34. And we're going to make a cut. So we go to features. Extruded cut. Gonna flip the direction. And then we're gonna insert the distance of 20.5. Click OK. And 
Now we're going to insert the fillet. Click fillet. So like this line, we're going to insert a fillet of 7.75. Okay, let's hide this plane. Now we're going to shell the lid. So select shell. Select this face because here will be an opening on this face. And we're going to shell it thickness of two. Now we're going to use fillet to round off the edges on the mouthpiece. So select fillet, type in one, select this edge and this edge. Click OK. Now we're going to model the parts that hold the flip cap together. We're going to select the front plane, go to reference geometry, select plane, and then select the distance of 21. And we're going to sketch on this plane. Select sketch. Then select center line. And draw a line from the origin to the right. Then up. Let's give these lines a dimension. This line will be 21. And this line will be 47. Now I want a line that follows this profile. So we're going to select intersection curve, click on this face, click OK. And then we have our line. And we're going to draw another center line connected to this line. Then I give this line a dimension of 8.5 and here a dimension of 18 and we're going to draw an arc here and we're going to draw a line from this point to this point and we're going to make the arc tangent. After that, we're going to mirror these lines. So select mirror entities. Select this line and this line. And then use the center line to mirror. And then we're going to trim all the entities that we don't need. So we don't need this line. We don't need that line. Click OK. Then we're going to extrude this profile. Select extrude bus base. Reverse direction. And we're going to extrude it by 4 millimeters. Click OK. Let's hide this plane. Then we're going to round off this edge with a fillet. Select fillet and let's make this a fillet of two millimeters. Now we're gonna create a hole for the flip cap. So select this face, sketch, and select the center line. We're gonna draw a center line from the top. Give this a dimension. Dimension of this line will be 9. And then we're going to draw a circle in the middle. So select circle. And we're going to give this circle a radius of 7. We're going to create a hole. So we go to features, extrude cut. Insert a distance of two millimeters. And we're going to mirror these features. We select mirror. We're going to select the plane. It will be the front plane. 
this feature, the fillet, and extrude cut. Click OK. We forgot to we forgot to mirror the fillet. Click fillet. Let's apply fillet here. Then we're going to draw a profile on this face. We're going to use section view. Click OK. We're first going to select convert entities. Click on this face. OK. Then we're going to trim the lines that we don't need. I'll select trim and remove all the lines click OK after that we use offset entities to create an offset click reverse the distance will be 3 click OK then we're going to draw a line from this point to this line, we're going to trim this line. And we're going to draw a line from this line to this line. And from this point to this point, it will have a distance of then trim these lines and then we have a profile leave section view select features extrude boss base then we want to extrude up until this face so we select up to the surface we select this surface Click OK. Now we're going to apply a couple more fillets. Select fillet at this face. It will have a fillet of 4. And up here at the bottom, we will give it a fillet of 8. The only thing we have to draw right now is screw thread. We're going to insert the plane. Use this face as a reference. Flip to the other side. We're going to insert the distance of 4. We're going to sketch on the plane. We're going to use intersection curve. Select this face. Then we have our circle, and we're going to hide the plane. And we're going to insert a spiral. So let's go to Features, Curves, DX and Spiral. The pitch and the revolutions are the same as the cup. So it will have a pitch of 4, revolutions of 2.05, it will go clockwise and we have to reverse the direction. Click OK. 
Uh, only thing we have to do is draw a profile. We go to the right plane, put sketch. We're gonna draw profile. We have another center line in the middle. That will be horizontal. We're gonna give this profile some dimensions. This line will have a dimension of two. Center line will have a dimension of 1.5. And this line will also have a dimension of 1.5. Then we can pierce the profile to the path. So select this point, hold shift, click on the path, select pierce, leave the sketch, and we go to features, swap boss base, click on the path, and then we have our screw thread. And we can finish it off with the chamfer. It will be 1.5. It will be 73 degrees. And we're going to flip the direction. Click OK. And click on fill it, this edge, this edge, click OK. And that's our lid. You can apply some other fillets. And we can also apply some material. Let's go to plastics medium gloss and give it this color and we're done with the lid next video we're going to draw the flip cap and the mixer bowl. So, hope to see you then. Thanks for watching.